today we are talking about Faith Evans. Reportedly, she has to pay Stevie J's spousal support. Also, we are going to be talking about Madonna. Reportedly, she had to be revived. We did not realize that her health condition was that serious. We're going to be talking about another diva. Beyonce, she had to cancel a tour date on her Renaissance tour. And what about those rumors that are out there about Cardi B? Also, we're going to be talking about Kiki Palmer out here, wild and out, living her best life as a new mom and cozying up to Usher at his Vegas show. These are the stories of discussion that we are going to be talking about today. So let's start with Faith Evans. And now the divorce is finalized between these two. And reportedly, according to Radar Online, is that Faith Evans, shockingly, has to pay Stevie J a million dollars in spousal support. So who knew that Faith Evans had more money than Stevie J? And if this is the case, people are wondering why did she marry Stevie J in the first place? Could it be that she thought that he would write her a hit? But did she really need to marry him for him to write a hit? That is, if he has another hit left in him. I mean, how many years ago has it been since Stevie J has written a hit for someone? People were shocked that these two got together in the first place because reportedly back in the 1990s they were both signed to bad boy records and reportedly that stevie j was a friend of notorious big who is faith evans ex-husband who was faith evans husband people are shocked to see that after stevie j was friends with notorious big that he had married Faith Evans. And what was even more shocking is that she would marry Stevie J after his stench on Love and Hip Hop and the roles that he played on this series. We saw how he was in the tumultuous relationship that he had with Jocelyn Hernandez, that he had with Jocelyn, and the love triangle between him Jocelyn and Mimi and then Faith Evans would cozy up to him and wind up marrying him this was very shocking indeed so I think it's safe to say that no one is surprised by the fact that these two are now divorced but what is shocking in this situation is that according to reports that she has to pay Stevie J almost a million dollars in spousal support. How could you let this happen to you? Faith, we thought that she pretty much had it all together. That is the reason that people were shocked that she would marry Stevie J. But nonetheless, these two made some type of connection. They were married, but now they are divorced. And reportedly, allegedly, she has to pay this man spousal support let us know what you think about this situation are you shocked that faith evan has to pay stevie j spousal support allegedly and were you shocked to find out that these two were getting married in the first place and if you are shocked to find out about this why were you shocked and also were you surprised that these two reportedly are now divorced make sure you leave a comment below and let us know what your thoughts are on this situation with stevie j and faith evans let's move on from talking about the singer faith evan and talk about another singer a living legend madonna it is very shocking to hear about the medical dish condition of madonna she had just announced that she was going on tour, but now to hear that she has a medical emergency is very shocking. 
so prayers go out to madonna and hopefully she will make a full recovery let's take a look at this report by radar online on madonna madonna was revived by narcan injection so it is very shocking to hear that she had to receive a narcan injection because reports before had reported that she had an infection and we thought that she was going to make a speedy recovery and was going to be able to go on tour but this seems to not be the case so it is very questionable whether or not madonna will make a full recovery so like i say prayers go out to madonna so according to radar online madonna was survived by narcon injection terrifying new details reveal that the queen of pop had to be brought back from being unalive so this is very shocking to hear that madonna had to be brought back from being unalive it says that madonna's brush with being unalive was far worse than anyone knows according to radar online they have an exclusive information on this they reported that when madonna was found unresponsive on june 24th those who discovered her lifeless body were forced to administer a narcan injection this is what sources are reporting so narcan reportedly is an emergency medical treatment commonly used to reverse the life-threatening effects of suspected overdose but they are saying that this was not the case for madonna because the narcan injection is also used to reverse acute septic shock in patients which is a condition that madonna is said to have suffered so this is reportedly what was going on with madonna allegedly she had acute septic shock now it is said that the injection commonly held in medical treatment kits of the rich and famous is considered useful to increase blood pressure and the management of septic shock which is a life-threatening condition that happens when blood pressure drops to a dangerous low level so reportedly allegedly this is what happened to madonna because they are saying that there is nothing at all to suggest that madonna needed narcan for the ill effects of a d-use so according to radar online madonna who is 64 was intubated for at least one night at a new york hospital before having the tube removed so that is good news to hear that she was able to have the tube removed they're saying that the official explanation has been that a serious bacterial infection put her into intensive care and reportedly according to radar online she has spent days hooked up to a ventilator while her family was told to expect the worst oh my goodness prayers go out to madonna hopefully she will recover from this they said that madonna they said that madonna is now alert and is surrounded by her family and friends so this is what is going on with madonna hopefully she will recover from this well let's move on and talk about another diva beyonce that is currently on tour reports is that she is going to be canceling one of her tour dates i am sure that many fans are going to be upset according to e-news beyonce just canceled upcoming stop on her renaissance tour that she was scheduled to do in pittsburgh and the reason is due to production logistics and scheduling issues so unfortunately the august 3rd stop in pittsburgh of the renaissance tour will not be taking place and it is reported that refunds will automatically be issued at point of purchase and that if fans have questions about their issues regarding their tickets that they are to contact their point of purchase so it is said that pittsburgh was to be one of the many stops on the u.s leg of queen bay's worldwide renaissance tour so this is what is going on with beyonce this is the first that we have heard of her canceling a tour date 
since she has been on this renaissance tour it seems like beyonce has been working hard with all those posts that we have seen her performances of her overseas leg of her renaissance tour and her daughter has been out there killing it on stage dancing with beyonce on this renaissance tour now as of late we have not seen blue ivy out there dancing which leads some to wonder if she will be making an appearance on her u.s leg of the renaissance tour but anyway this is what is going on with beyonce she is continuing her renaissance tour but she has made a canceling of the stop that she was scheduled to do in pittsburgh on august the 3rd let's talk about what is going on with kiki palmer her baby daddy is not too happy with her right about now it all happened because she was in vegas with the girls and uh, she was watching usher perform usher spotted her in the crowd and decided to serenade kiki palmer you know that song that he serenades the ladies with there goes my baby and he was singing and she was uh pretty close to usher you know she was not doing anything out of the ordinary after all she was what appeared to be on a girl's night out and she was playing her role letting russia serenade her and she was dancing it all and then she did a little twirl and we saw that her butt cheeks were out she had on an outfit that showed all her goodies showed all her behind and her baby daddy was highly upset about this you know this is what he took to social media and posted that she should not have that outfit on you know she is a mother after all so he was alluding to that she should not be showing her butt cheeks like that but that leads some to wonder is that really why he mad because she had on a revealing outfit or was he mad because she was so close up on usher and usher was serenading her i mean was that a deflection by him to let us know that he was upset but he really didn't want us to know what he was all mad about but yeah this is what is going on with kiki palmer apparently she has that mom body and everything is popping in all the right places and she is living her best life showing on that new body of hers but that baby daddy he's not too happy about her showing that body around town allegedly so this is what is going on let us know what you think about this do you think that he had a right to take to social media to complain about the outfit that she had on did he not know that he was getting with a celebrity and this is what comes along with the territory but anyway yeah kiki is out there living her best life well moving on from kiki let's talk about another diva cardi b who was spotted out and about and she was saying that she is pregnant look at her pregnant stomach but i think that the girl was just trolling you know how cardi b trolls you know she was talking about look at her stomach and talking about she is pregnant so i took a look at her instagram page there is no announcement on her instagram page saying that she is pregnant and do you think that she was break the news while she's out and about in paris to the paparazzi out there in paris so to me it is obvious that the girl was trolling and uh you know it looks like her stomach was kind of a little bit big but it looks like you know she could have been eating a lot you know it could she could have just gained a little weight in the stomach area so my, in my opinion she was just trolling it was just cardi being cardi but one thing that stuck out as well is that she was back together with offset she and offset are hanging out together there in paris so you know offset had took to social media accusing cardi b of cheating and cardi b had a clap back say you cannot accuse me of things that you know that you are guilty of she broke out that keisha cole song saying that she should have cheated if she knew that she was gonna accuse her of what you are doing 
but of course cardi b denied those cheating accusations so was offset just in his feeling because people were hitting cardi b up in her dm and then he was accusing her of cheating on him but it appears that these two have reconciled their differences and they are together once again in paris so let us know what you think about this isn't it beautiful to see a couple together once again do you think that there is trouble in paradise and that they are just doing this for show or do you think that it's just you know turmoil that was in the relationship that can be expected you know of a husband or wife every now and then they go through some things so let us know what you think about the entire cardi b offset situation and isn't it wonderful that offset has reunited with quavo and they did that beautiful performance there and they paid tribute to take off when they did that performance at the bet awards is this a sign that these two are going to be making music together and that they are going to come together to be a group once again but anyway this is what is going on with cardi b and offset let us know what you think about this make sure you leave a comment below and what do you think about all of the topics that we have been discussing today busy bodies you have to get busy and leave a comment and let us know your thoughts and opinion on these topics let me remind you what the topics were we discussed faith evans and stevie J whatever possess her to marry this man and what do you think about allegedly now that she's going to have to pay him spousal support get busy and leave a comment below also what about madonna and the shocking news about her having to be administered narcon to be brought back from being unalive are you shocked about this let us know what your feelings are about madonna and her situation and what about beyonce canceling a tour date are you surprised what do you think her fans will think about her canceling this tour date and also what about kiki palmer out there all up on usher performing serenading her do you think that she was just having fun on a girl's night out do you think her baby daddy overreacted to this make sure you leave a comment below and last but not least what about cardi b out there talking about to the paparazzi rubbing her stomach talking about look at her pregnant stomach do you think that she was just trolling the paparazzi or do you think that she might be expecting baby number three let us know what you think about these topics get busy and leave your comment below and as always thank you so very much for stopping by my page don't forget to like this video give this video a thumbs up do your part and come back and watch my next video make sure you subscribe to this youtube channel this is liz keep up with the biz and i am out it's liz with the biz 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 it's Liz with the beers. Yo, this is Liz with the beers. It's Liz with the beers telling it how it is. And she gon' keep it real cause it is what it is. It is what it is. Yo, this is Liz with the beers.